Even a lot of my friends don't realize how long Ford's been working in autonomy. I started out 10 years ago in the DARPA challenge days, and we've been working diligently and steadfastly that entire time trying to advance the technology. Is this really possible? Is fully autonomous driving really possible? Because people have been talking about it since, you know, the 50s. And it was always sort of a dream, but people were, were always saying, yeah, but it's going to be difficult for all these different reasons. A lot of the driving rules that expert drivers use, they're actually things that can be distilled into algorithms. We can make the autonomous vehicle have that knowledge. It can understand how to regain control of the vehicle in situations that a typical driver just wouldn't know because they haven't received that training. In 2004, when DARPA conducted their first grand challenge, they asked for some industrial partners to come help them stage the show. In subsequent years, after having seen the first event, it became obvious to me that if you could make a car that was smart enough to drive itself, you could probably make a car that was smart enough to be a, a lot safer. And not only did we participate and reach the finals, but we also collaborated and partially supported two of the other finalists in the race. Sensing is really key, and how you process that sensing to make decisions on where to go is really important for autonomy. The holy grail in solving a problem of making a car drive itself is to have a 3D picture of the world around you. When we thought of making a better 3D picture of the world, what came to my mind was using laser scanners in the form of LiDAR. We could make a 3D picture at great fidelity out to hundreds of meters. It was a much more efficient way to directly measure distances to everything around you. I think this is the most exciting challenge I've had in my career because this is an area that absolutely is in the forefront of everybody's mind right now. And it's just really fascinating to be working in an area that captures everybody's imagination. It's something everybody wants to talk about. Now, I think there's been a critical mass of engineering talent applied to this problem. And enough of the hard problems have been overcome that people are starting to say, you know, wow, this looks like this is going to happen. The autonomous vehicle platform we're developing can be applied to any of the products we make. Everything from a Focus all the way up to Super Duty. And that's really the power of Ford Motor Company in that we make a lot of vehicles. And we can bring this technology to a lot of people.